Wow. Wow. It's snap deuce. Deuce. Oh my god. Wow. How you all doing? Hello. Hello, it's me. It's me. Yippee. 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 It's me, Alpus. Wow. We. Oh my god, it's we. <laughs> Thank you so much, a Valkyrie kiss for uh, the raid ma. Thank you very much for the raid ma. Last epoch, e epoch. I don't know how to say that, but I've heard that that game is pretty good. I don't know. Is it good? Let me know. I hope you had fun. My name is Alfie. Nice to meet you. I like tanks, and I'm a history nerd. Nice to meet you. Yeah. yeah. Hello, Jenny. Hello, how you doing? Hello. Uh, all your first impressions are so-so. Oh shit. Can we get a shout out to Jenny? Hello. I see you replying to my tweets. So that means... That means we're friends, right? <laughs> I hope you, are you my friend. Can we hold hands? Thanks. Yippee. My name is Alfie. Wow. Also, thank you so much, Moon Pirates, for the 33 months in a row. Thank you, that's a very long time. I'm not sure how you have endured my insanity this long. I think that you should be awarded. You're Swedish? You're Swedish? What? What? You're Swedish? What? <laughs> what? You're sweet? Oh my god! <laughs> Sorry, I got really excited. There's not many, like. Other, like, I don't know, I... <laughs> it's crazy. <laughs> it's such a coincidence that we're both Swedish, that's crazy. Okay. You don't need to answer if, if you're not com comfortable, but are you also a southerner or no? I, as so far, I'm the only Swedish VTuber who's from the south, and I feel very lonely with my shitty accent. It makes me sad. I speak weird. It makes me... I, I, I'm a weirdo. I speak weird. Everyone makes fun of me for my accent. I'm just a girl trying my best, you know? I'm just a girl trying my best. Oh my god. A surprise stream? It's not a surprise stream. It was scheduled for today. I always s stream on... Uh, hello, it's a cute... Oh, hello, Shoto. How are you doing? It's a cute accent. You like it? Wow, thank you, thank you, wowie. Uh, so basically, when I speak my native language, Swedish, right? I have a very strong accent. I have like, in America, I guess it would be the equivalent of having a southern accent, like a southern, like, mm, very strong southern accent. Mm. So I have a Swedish southern accent, yes, yes. So I sound like a farmer, kind of. <laughs> Hello, you wanna buy my vegetables? I have a fine selection. <laughs> actually used to grow vegetables as well, which doesn't really help my case. But I'd say I was pretty good at it, you know? I, I I grew some fire carrots, not to brag or anything, but I think Shad would really like my carrots. Also, we had like a, a black currant. You guys know black currants? You sound like you do VA. Really? I mean, technically, I mean, I've done voice acting for my lore videos, you know, the ones Mary wrote for me, but that's about it, I suppose. I can do like a, like a bad, I can kind of sound like an American, but only if I do a very cursed voice, I can do like... Hello everyone, I'm an American citizen. I would like to order a bacon hamburger, please. Let me use my credit card. I can sound pretty American. <laughs> But only if I do that accent. Not not otherwise. But yeah, nice to meet you, Shoro. Nice to, you like Moomin? Have you heard about Moomin before? Moomin's pretty pog. I'm gonna teach chat all about Moomin today. This is a Moomin educational stream today. You guys have probably heard about Snupkin, right? He's the the guy with the the green hat. He plays uh Oh my god, what is it called in English? I don't know what it's called in English. It's like a little instrument you blow into. 
and it, it makes a funny noise. <laughs> I don't know what it's called in English. My words escape me. Nice to meet you. Well, yeah, it's nice to meet you. Wowie. A harmonica. Yes, yes, thank you. It's a harmonica. Yes. So he plays the harmonica. And he's just a little guy, you know, adventuring and chilling out, you know? Yeah, he's just a guy. Yeah. Uh, so, yeah, today we are sponsored to play Moving Game, which I'm very excited about. I might have simped the developers a little bit. The text I wrote to them to get the sponsorship was very like, Hello, did you know I like Moomin a lot? I have a lot of merch in my house of Moomin, and I think that I would do a good job. <laughs> it was basically me. And they were like, yeah, of course. And I was like, yeah, thank you. I am honored. I am so honored right now. I was so happy. Um... I don't know. I have a lot of Moomin mugs. So like, in, um, there are, Moomin is like cartoon characters, like from children's books, right? Mm. Written by a Finnish, Swedish woman called Tove Jansson. And these mugs, uh, they're porcelain mugs. They are very oh, valuable collector's great. items. And people take it extremely seriously. Like, think like, what are, what are they called? Beanie Babies? Bean Babies? Or whatever. Think like that, but like... The fandom is more insane. Right? So, the people who collect these mugs, they're kind of crazy. You know? Um, and some of these mugs, they sell for like... $3,000 or more. Depending on the rarity. And my mom actually has one of these mugs. And I think the mug she has is worth like 400 uh, but she has, to, like, she doesn't use it. She's just on display, you know? Because if she uses it, it will <laughs> decrease in value. And, uh, well, that's not exactly good, right? So, yeah. Moomin. Being babies. I don't know. I was trying to think of, like, a collector's item that many people know. And it was, like, the first thing that popped into my mind, you know? I don't know. What, what, what do the kids collect these days, except for V-Bucks? Mom, I need money to buy my gacha waifus. Uh... I, w I want to pull for for my waifu, please, mom. I don't know, I feel like... Mm, for me, collecting in real life is more satisfying. Maybe it's just me. But I like to see my, my loot, my goblin loot in front of me, right? I like to... I don't know. I like to hoard my stuff uh, and have it visible in front of me. Yes. I don't really hoard that much though. Mika figures is like my vice. I would say, yeah, Mika, Mika figures. <laughs> That's like my vice. I have like 10 right now. Uh, 10 Mika figures. But I haven't gotten a glass cabinet to display them yet. And I kind of got scared, right? Because uh, my friend Lumi, you know, my uh, gen mate Lumi, uh, she had bought a huge glass cabinet uh, from Ikea and it burst, like it exploded in her living room. Like the glass somehow got so pressured or something that it just fucking exploded. And I googled and apparently this is a thing with like this Ikea furniture. Yeah. And it can also have... It was fucking crazy, man. It just exploded. She sent me pictures. I was like, what? Lumi, what did you do? Did you... I was like, did you put too many figures on the... Like... On the display? She was like, no. And she sent me pictures. There was like glass everywhere. I was like, what the fuck? Lumi. Yeah, so now I'm like scared to have a glass cabinet. Maybe I shouldn't buy the IKEA one. Maybe I should buy like a better one. I don't know. Uh, my Swedish accent. I can speak a little bit Swedish. Heisan, jag heter Alfilde, och jag har ganska grov dialekt när jag pratar svenska. Men den har den har blivit mindre grov över åren. Men man kan fortfarande höra att jag har ganska grov dialekt. Typ när jag säger båd eller godis. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Watching you both on YouTube and Twitch. Oh my god. You're multitasking. I hope you don't have the audio on at the same time. That would be very confusing. Thank you so much for the head pat. 
You have a Sakura Miku figure. <gasps> Me too. I have two Sakura Mikus. They are the best. And yesterday, I was looking at Miku figures, of course, and I found like three that I want to buy. And I was like, oh, <laughs> I know where my Twitch payout is going to this month, baby. <laughs> you know? <laughs> yeah. I was like, damn, son. The audio is very confusing, I can imagine. Wouldn't an acrylic one or plastic one work too? Mm, yeah, that would work. I like it the mo mostly I want the cabinet just because I don't... If you have it open on a shelf, it's like dusty. But if you have a door, you can shut. You don't really have the same issue, right? You can just keep it there. It's nice and pretty and stuff. Looks organized, etc. You can put lights in it, you know? You can put pink lights too much with the Miku. With the pink Miku. Ooh. You know? That accent sounds so close to it. <laughs> Ooh, spicy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go crazy. It's crazy. Oh my god, it's, the f it's a fake shot though, it's not the real one. I got bamboozled. You know, impersonating people is not pog. It's unpog actually. I thought it was a real one. You fake. You're fake. You're stinky. Make up your own my uh, name. Man. <laughs> <sighs> oh, you're just a fan? <laughs> yeah, I thought you were the real one. <laughs> it's okay, but I think you should you should like rename your your YouTube channel to like Shoto fan or something. Because I don't think that Shoto would appreciate that he you know that you're imitating him. I don't think so. So was Tove Finnish? You spoke Swedish. Yes, so I want to tell you guys all about it, basically. Oh, you will? Okay, good. Because, like, I don't know Shoto personally, but, per like, for me, if someone, like, was my fan and made a, ma a channel named Alfilde and went around and talked to people, I would I, I would not like it, okay? Like, I, it would make me quite pissed. Like, maybe not pissed off, but... Um, I, I think anxious. It would make me anxious, yeah. Hmm. Anyway, so I want to tell you guys all about Moomin, right? So, Moomin, uh, let's bring, bring up some pictures so you guys can... I can tell you about Moomin. Okay. Uh, maybe like a picture of the different characters would be good. So we can go through who is who. And also, I don't know their English names. Uh, all of them. So, maybe some English viewers can help me. Okay. So, Moomin, right? Uh, this is uh, some of the characters from Moomin, which is, we are playing Moomin today. Moomin, Moomin. And the green one here is Snufkin in English. Uh, I know his name in English. And in, in Swedish, it's called Snusmumiken, which I think sounds way better, right? And then we have, uh, like, in front of him, we have Moomin. Just, his name is just Moomin, right? And he's a very good boy. And, um... Snåkfröken. That's her name. I don't know her name in English. I'm sorry. Probably someone else knows this name. Uh, Snorkmaiden. Her name is Snorkmaiden in English. Okay. And then we have Moomin Pappa. Which is... I don't know if the same in... But, like, yeah, that's Moomin's dad. Moomin Papa, and then we have Moomin Mama, and and then we have uh, Little Me, right? Uh, Lilla Me in in Swedish, right? And I think in Finnish it's called Picku Me, Picku Me. Mm. And these are like the main characters in the in the books, right? So yeah, main main characters, and basically. They live in a big blue house. Uh, wait, there's one other uh, 
character that's not here. Uh. Oh my god, what is it? Uh, what is it? Sniff! 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 Yes, Sniff! Sniff is not here in this picture. We must to show Sniff, right? I imagine Sniff is probably gonna be in the game. Like, I imagine that he is gonna be in the game. So maybe we should show him and explain who he is. Yeah, his name is Sniff. Uh, a race, it's like a fake Shodo fan, but not the real one. Anyway, uh, I also got tricked, lol. It happens. Yeah, I know. It's okay. So, I'm gonna show you guys this one. This is like basically where they live, right? This is Moomin Dalen, Moomin Valley. And as you can see, it's a very beautiful place. Um, very beautiful place, right? Lots of flowers and they're, they're just hanging out. They're just hanging out. And this is Sniff. Uh, the the guy with the long ears here and the big snout, a little tail, that sniff, and he's very kind of mm, a bit a bit scared of everything. Like he uh, gets scared easily, and yeah, uh, Snow's Mimikin is very chill, kind of philosophical dude. He's like a soft boy that plays harmonica, and like he's very comfy. He was like my first crush when I was a kid. I was like obsessed with him. I was like, oh, I want a boy like this. He <laughs> goes around in nature and just chills, you know. <laughs> yeah, when I grow up, I want, I want, I want Snufkin to be my boyfriend. <laughs> it was me when I was a kid. Yeah. And then uh, Moomin, he's kind of also a little bit scared, I guess. But uh, he likes to go on. Uh, adventures and he loves snook for a can. They are in love, they kiss, hold hands, and they're very cute. It's his girlfriend, right? And Lila Mish is like adopted by the Moomin family, and uh, she's very, very mischievous. And she tries to like prank people all the time. She gets angry sometimes, uh, but she's also very caring and loving. So she's like a bit chaotic, but actually she's like very, very kind and precious. Yeah, she's like a little, sh yeah, she's a little shit, but she, she's loving, you know, yeah. And then Moomin Mama, she's just like pure radiance and kindness. She's so nice. Like she is so kind to everyone. Moomin Papa, he is more protective and really kind. Are me and Snufkin related? No, no, they're not. I don't think so. Uh, yeah, Snus Mumikin and Milami, oh, they have siblings. Yeah, that's true. And then Milami also has a, has a sister, but uh, she's like a side character. So she, she doesn't really show up much. Like, I don't think she will show up in the game. She might, but like, I don't know. Um... But anyway, and this blue house is where they live, right? Yeah. The blue house is where they live and it's very cute, this house. And um, yeah, and in case you haven't seen the 90s cartoon or like the more recent cartoons, maybe today you will learn some stuff about Moomin. I am basically a Moomin expert. Uh, well, I think, uh, to be honest, it's not really an accomplishment because I think like most Scandinavians are movement experts <laughs> uh, but I am I am a big movement enjoyer uh, I have a lot of like I said I have a lot of uh, movement mugs and I also have egg cups with movement on them and movement means so much to me like I can't even explain like Whenever I'm sad, I sometimes put on Moomin and I just watch and I drink some tea and eat some cookies and I'm like, nothing can hurt me. I am safe here, you know. 
Yeah, and also something that's interesting about the movies, right? The, the TV show. Because... Um, because... Um, Tove Jansson, she, you know, she's Finnish. But she belongs to the Swedish-speaking minority in Finland, which means she is... A, even if she is Finnish, she was a native Swedish speaker. Like, she... Her first language was Swedish, okay? So that means that the Moomin books were in Swedish. And also, the Moomin characters in the TV show, they spoke... They speak Swedish with a Finnish accent. They speak Swedish with a Finnish accent, so they have this very, like... Specific accent that's very, very cute and very, like... Comfy. And I think that if you watch Moomin in English, you will not get this kind of experience. Like for me, for me, seeing Moomin without this accent is like, oh my God, I can't imagine. Like they have to have that accent. Otherwise it's not the same, right? Yeah, it's the way Tove would have wanted it, <laughs> you know? Um, yeah. Hello Mika, welcome, welcome. But yeah, uh... How to become a VTuber? You know, I'm sure there's a mil Like, when I started out, it was kind of difficult, but like... I'm sure if you Google on YouTube these days, how to become a VTuber, you will get like 500 results. And they can explain way better than I can, because, you know, I'm gonna be playing Moomin today. Uh, so I'm gonna be a bit busy. Yeah, there's audiobooks read by Tove, yeah. Uh, so yeah, I... Uh, I love Moomin so much. Moomin is cute mom. And I can't wait to play this game today. It's gonna be so much fun. It's gonna be a very epic gaming. How to be a cute VTuber. Oh, a cute VTuber. Oh, that's a bit different. Uh, first of all, you need to buy a lot of candy and eat it all in one go. And then start your iPhone, and then you go live. Yeah. This is the only way. You need your candy. Hmm. Oh. How to be a cute VTuber. Which dub is the original? Yeah, that's a hard question. Because, like, the series was produced in Japan, but then it was... You know... It's also... It was also popular in Sweden and Finland, so like, it's hard to know like which one is the original dub, because you could argue it's the Japanese one. You could also argue it's the Finnish one. Or you could argue it's the Swedish one. Like, it's hard to say, like, which one is the original one in a scenario. You know, you know the Garfield Door com Girl comic or girl is like that with with movement. <laughs> Mm, uh, I don't know. I feel like, like I said, most Scandinavians and Nordic people just love Moomin. Like, period. I don't think, if anyone say I don't like Moomin, I'm like, what? Are you even Nordic, bro? You know? Are you even... And like, when I went to the Finnish airport, I went to Finland to fly to America. I know that's weird because like, going backwards and then going... The other way it's kind of like complicated but it was cheaper that way okay uh so i went to helsinki airport and they had moomin in a costume like a like a yurukara right like a mascot and oh my god bro i was cr i was freaking out i was like oh, holy shit it's moomin <laughs> i have a picture of him and uh, and like uh, oh i'm so embarrassed because i was smiling so much like, because Moomin had like this like handler, like, you know, because I don't think the person in the costume can see it that well, you know. Uh, and uh, the person could see me smiling a lot. And I was like smiling and looking and smiling. And she was like, oh, do you want to hug Moomin? I was like, um, no, I don't know. No, uh, of course I wanted to. I, <laughs> I wanted to hug Moomin, but I was too shy. So I was like, no. No, <laughs> so then I just took a picture, but I kind of regret like not hugging women because I, I felt so awkward because like I was like, oh, I'm an adult. 
people will think I'm weird for hugging movement. <laughs> you know? <laughs> people will see. Like, because all these kids are like, oh, look, mom, it's movement. And then I was like, there, I was like, oh my god, it's movement. Like, literally, an adult woman freaking out. <laughs> A real sea dog freeze moment. Oh yeah, I, I'm, I'm still embarrassed about the fact that I looked Connor straight in the eye and then I froze and then I looked away and then I looked at him again. And he probably thought that I was like scared of him or something. <laughs> I kind of was to be honest. It's scary to like meet the person you've seen so much online. I was scared of like saying anything wrong uh, everyone was like no connor's nice and i was like yeah i'm sure but i'm scared <laughs> you know i don't want to bother anyone i don't want to be annoying i don't want to like i don't want to be annoying to people i, don't, I didn't want to be annoying to moomin either you know I, I i wish i had hugged him though like oh imagine how soft he would be like when I hug a moomin. Oh, so soft. Yeah. When I was in Sweden for the first time, uh, you flew to Kiruna, really? How was it? Did you watch the Northern Lights? I've actually uh, never seen the Northern Lights in my entire life. I know it's crazy because, like, a lot of people think, oh, Sweden is so far up north. So everyone in Sweden has seen the Northern Lights. No. I grew up in the south, and now I live in a big city, and there's too much light pollution here to see it. Like, I know that, like, uh, last year, you could see it, but I went outside and I didn't see anything, so... Uh, I must have, like, missed it, or maybe it wasn't, like, visible where I lived. Because uh, I was, like, outside several times, and people, like, online were like, oh, it's visible, and I went outside. Nothing! And then I went outside again. Nothing. I, I don't know if I like missed it, the window or like maybe like where I lived it wasn't visible. I don't know. But I really want to see the Northern Lights someday. I think it would make me really happy. You know? You haven't seen them really in a long time. I have never seen them. I mean, I used to live in the South. So like the only thing I saw in the sky was grief and airplanes, guys. And like... I don't know, birds. Canada goose. I used to see airplanes a lot. All the time. Uh, when I lived there. They were loud as fuck. Sometimes they would fly too low. And it would like make my window shake. Like I'm not even joking. Like it would make the entire window shake. And it may, would... Sometimes it would make me really scared. Like... Uh, because the, the like, entire house is shaking. And I know that the flight regiment got a lot of complaints uh, from people who lived nearby because they kept flying too low all the time. Uh, and a lot of people, like especially farmers, uh, their like animals got really scared. Uh, so that was not nice. Yeah. Yeah, Mormon. Mommin! Wow, 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 wow. Head Patma? Head Patma. Shungus. And also, uh, I don't really want to talk about the thing that happened. Uh, <clears throat> you guys know, probably. If you don't know, you can go to my Twitter or my Discord. I think we can talk about it on Saturday. I hope that's okay, so please not mention uh, my dog today, okay? Do not mention her, thank you. I would appreciate it. I don't want to cry, <laughs> okay? <laughs> yeah. So I will talk about it on Saturday, guys, and I'll explain, like, stuff properly. Mm, today we're gonna get comfy with Moomin. Mm. No, Alfie, no, Al oh god, I have cried so much, guys, you have no idea. Uh, but we can talk more about it later, it's okay. 
Moving on. Are you sure you want to talk about it? Mm, a little bit. Like, I want to talk about it a little bit. You see, Block. I've seen Blackhawk twice. Uh, but it was like. Long time ago. They're quite big and quite loud. Standing next to one is very uncomfortable for the ears. Did you know? It's very loud when you stand next to one. Actually, it's not that nice. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I have been standing that close to one at once. And it was so loud. Holy shit, bro. And it, it like made my hair fly around like crazy. Mm. Really? There's a base? Oh, okay, okay. Yeah. I understand. Shrongus. Moomin. The one whole alive with her. Is the No. Is that What? There's no whole alive with <laughs> Moomin. Uh. I've been watching Okayu a lot, like, the past few days. I don't know why. Like, I find her voice so calming for me. I don't know. I'm Mume! I'm Mume! <laughs> yeah, I guess it's similar to Mume. Mm. We had a big air show here and I'm pissed. Really? <gasps> wow. Why didn't you go? You, you, had, you had to work or you were busy or something? Man, that's so unfortunate. That would have been lovely. I would have loved to go to an air show. What if what if we went to the air show and held hands? Oh my god, that would be so crazy. Ah. <laughs> ah. Wowie. I like when it was moving time and she'd moved all over the What the f <laughs> What does that mean? Oh you didn't know what was happening. Oh, okay. Um, they usually have a flight show once a year, but recently, the past year, they haven't had one because of security threat reasons. <laughs> kind of bored, you know. It's you know the world is doing stuff. Mm. Yeah, yeah. I hope it gets better soon. Hope we can all relax more and be comfy. No more bad, please. Only comfy. It really is movement. Yeah, we should. Okay, like hot take. We should all aspire to live like in Moomin Valley. Like that is the utopia that we want. Like we need to just replicate movement. Then we can reach comfiness. Love the vibes and the music is great. Thank you. I appreciate. It. Remember, remember happy day. <laughs> When times are hard, man, be happy. I'm always maximum comf. I'm glad. Being maximum comf is very important. I remember the US flu so many that's over my town. Really? Wow, wow, wow. I have Kirby nails. Kirby nail. You guys want to see my Kirby nails? Hand reveal. I'm such a slut showing my hands to you guys. Uh, let me see him. Man, it's so hard to take pictures of nails. Did you guys know? It's really hard. Like, actually. Okay. Let me show you my Kirby nails. Kirby nail. Kirby, 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 Kirby. Kirby, Kirby, Kirby. Holy shit. Yeah, I know, guys. Which one is your favorite, Kirby? I, I just like Kirby. <laughs> I'm boring. Right, epic. Wowie. Are you tattoos? Yes, I have a tattoo on my arm. It's Sailor Moon tattoo. I think I've showed it a couple of times. I don't think I have any picture on my computer. Do those not get in the way? Not really, no. They're kind of short for nails. I like I like to keep like 
I like when the nails are not as long. Like this is like the maximum length I can handle. Do they last? Uh, they last like five days. If you are more careful, they can last like probably a week or more, but I am very clumsy. Um, so like for me personally, they often fall off and I have to glue them back on. Uh, so like for me, they last like five, five days to a week ish, you know, I don't know. Like I, I've tried to get better at application. I follow a lot of guides and stuff like that. And a lot of girls online are like, oh, you can make them last for three weeks. Bitch, how? Bitch, how? I don't understand. Like, because I don't understand. What are they doing? Like, I have to clean stuff. I have to like, I don't understand. Like, how, what do you mean? I have to go to the gym with these nails. What do you mean they last three weeks? Like, what are these women doing? Like nothing? Are they just sitting all day, like reading books or something? Like, I don't know. I don't understand. Like a lot, yeah, a lot of people online are like, "Oh, they last three weeks." How? Like, yeah, the keyboard is not hard to use. Like Eva says, the hardest thing is probably using contact lenses. It's difficult. Like I can do it, but it's it's difficult. Uh, and and scrubbing things, uh, like when you're cleaning, is also very very dangerous when you have these kinds of nails because you know sometimes you want to scrub a little hard and whoops one nail is off instantly you know uh i don't i don't understand how these pe other people do it man i don't get it hello razor pie welcome how you doing someone complimented my hair thank you i have a lot of other hair too on this model Mm. But yeah, I don't usually have nails on na nails like this on that often. I do sometimes, like when I I don't know when I feel like it. If I'm like, I need to be sheared up, which I need to be right now. So I used to get them professionally done, like by a nail lady, right? But it's very expensive and mine would often fall off all the time um i don't know if my hands are just bad for nails or something i don't know but or maybe i'm just clumsy i don't know nobody knows yartsa thank you so much for the eight months thank you very much thank you thank you thank you for the six months wow, 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 wow. and thank you so much for my hybrid for the seven months just a eventual reminder that Alfie is as cute as she is weird, and she is very weird. What? Am I really that weird? I don't know. And thank you, Risma, for the 33 months as well. Thank you. And Mr. Ham as well. Thank you, Mr. Ham. Do you want me to pull up the clips? What? 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 What do you mean clips? You seem normal to me. I don't think I, I don't think I'm particularly normal. I'll be real, because first of all, deciding to be a VTuber is not exactly the most normal thing to do. But that's okay. Like, um, I had a, a a boss once, uh, you know, and when I had a a, a job at a, at a cafe here in Osgard, um, you know, I had it was this older Valkyrie lady, and I said to her like, "Oh, I'm weird." And she said, oh, no, sweetie, you're not that weird, you know, it's OK. And I looked at her and I said, nah, like denying that I'm weird is just not good. Like, I, it's untrue. I think like I am weird, but that's OK. You know, I embrace it. I embrace it. It's OK. Oh, my God, my Malian is exposing me. I can't believe this. It is good to be weird. Yeah. Okay, I might be short, but at least I have a, a spicy personality. You know? For sure. I can be spicy. Mm. 
Give me your weirdest side right now. This is the weirdest demand I've ever read in my chat. Be weird now, king. Be weird now. Show your weirdness, you freak. Do it. Uh, I don't know what I would do that would be considered weird exactly. I, I don't... I have no idea what you're asking me to do. I don't really understand their request. You know, I think I'm just gonna be a little creature today and play Moomin and vibe. I have the absolute most impeccable vibes. You never send it to Mary? Mary is a we weird, you know, he's a, he, a, he's my brother and he's also weird, but it's okay. You know, it runs in the family. That's why, that's why we're so powerful as a family. We have all the, the flavors of weirdness and together we are strong. Together as a family. I love, I love Astralian so much. I do. I have like five pictures of all the Astralian members on my fridge, you know. Mm. Do an autism. <laughs> <laughs> what? My mom would never say that. <laughs> mm, my mom would like... Mm, I did this thing uh, that would drive my mom insane. I think I've mentioned it before. I, uh, My mom, one Christmas, she gave me a Nintendo DS. A Nintendo DS Lite, specifically. It was a red, uh, very based console, in, in my opinion. And uh, I was playing Pokemon Pearl. And eventually I, I played this game so much that I learned all the soundtrack on every route and area from memory. So that even when my mom would be like, can you, Alfie, can you turn off the sound? I'd be like, okay, mom, I turn off the sound. But I, instead of that, I start humming the soundtrack from memory. And it would drive my mom insane. She'd be like, Alfie, please, please, Alfie, can you be silent? Please, Alfie. Alfie, please. And I'd be like, oh, I'm sorry, I'm just vibing. <laughs> I'm just vibing. I, Mom, I like your soundtrack so much. It's so... Like... And like, I'd like bounce back and forth while I was humming it. Because it was like calming to me. You know? Now I wasn't trolling her. I was doing it to like... Uh, calm myself. Like... Like a... Uh, I don't know, it was like a sooth soothing behavior, kind of. Mm. Yeah, I was stimming, basically, yeah. You're just doing a little stimming moment, yeah. I didn't, I actually asked my mom this very recently. I called her and I asked her, like, questions about me as a kid. Because, like, obviously, right? It was a long time ago. I'm, I'm a thousand years old, you know, I'm a Valkyrie, I'm old. So, like, I was asking her if I did, like, the hand flapping thing. And I didn't, apparently. She said, no, you never hand flap. Um... And I didn't really like rock back and forth much. Like, like a lot of those like typical autistic things I actually didn't do. Which probably is why I got my diagnosis a lot later than most people. I got diagnosed when I was 14 years old, which is kind of late. So I didn't really do a lot of those typical things. But a lot of noise, I did a lot of noises. Mm, I still do, obviously, guys, no. <laughs> like, people ask, oh, why do you put ma at the end of stuff? Why, like, why do you repeat words so much? Like, oh, Alfie, do you have tics? No, I don't have tics. I have something called echolalia. It's different. It's very different. Tics is, like, when you repress a tic, it can be actually painful for the person. Uh, but for me, I can I can repress my words and it doesn't affect me. It just feels good to say it, you know? Yeah, it's different. It's not the same thing. And I kind of want to be very specific about that the fact that it is a, s a different thing. You know? Because having ticks is actually like... People might make fun of it, but I don't think you should because actually it's very stressful and painful for the person. Like, it can be very distressing, you know? It's not something that's fun to live with. You know? I 
Odin gives ticks to to his strongest warriors, you know. It do be like that. But yeah. Uh, I still like when I replay Pokemon Pearl someday on stream, maybe. I don't know. It's kind of a... I don't know, like, what is the longest Pokemon game? Is it Heart Gold and Soul Silver? Like, is it, is it, is it that? Like, which one, in terms of game time, is the longest uh, Pokemon game? Because I don't know this. I'm a casual Pokemon fan. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not a real gamer, guys. I'm sorry. I wonder which uh, Pokemon game has the most content. I've never really considered it. Heart Gold and Soul Server. Pearl and Diamond? Really? Oh, it is Diamond and Pearl. So people seem to be a bit conflicted about what is the longest Pokemon game. But like, I feel like it's being Pokemon, po like Pearl and Diamond would make sense. Because I remember playing it so much. And... It's being kind of long. You know? I kind of remember. Infinite Fusion? Is that like a mod or something? I don't think I've heard about it before. Mod ma? Infinite Fusion ma? Yeah. Creature. I'm just a creature. Oh, it's a mod. Okay. Yeah, but I mean, there's shield games to play, you know. Also, you guys, uh, I wanted to remind you all that if you wanted to buy the merch, the Dark Valkyrie merch, there's only two days left now. So if you've been like wavering about like back and forth on it, you know, uh, now is the time, guys. The gremlins are going to take it away soon, TM, and it's not going to come back. So when it's gone, it is gone forever. Okay. Your Honor, she's just a creature. Your Honor, I am a creature. Forgive my crimes. But yeah, remember to check out the merch if you're interested, because it's going to be gone soon, forever. There will be other merch in the future, of course. And then the uh, Sven... Plushy and the ducky and the mouse pad will go on sale uh, later this spring. Hopefully. So that will be very exciting. But of course, not Sven, not Sven ducky. <laughs> like, the, uh, Alfie ducky. Me, me, it's me. And uh, Sven keychain. It's a Sven plushy keychain. I, I, I just imagine a very muscular Sven. Giga, giga muscle, muscle Sven. We want Sven Daki. I don't think you do. Hey, if you want furry stuff, I can rec can I recommend to you my brother Nick Nocturne, uh, creator of Nightmind on YouTube. He is indeed a big fuzzy muscular cat. Uh, yeah, if you're into that kind of stuff, I would highly recommend that you check out my brother. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Nah. <laughs> don't project like on Sven like this, guys. Don't, don't, don't. Hmm. Blip, 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 blip. Buff, buff fox anime man, man. My god. You guys. There will be no buff Sven. No, no buff Sven. Ifa. How you doing today, Ifa? Now I want to see a buffed Astraline Mask of Gym picture. <laughs> Ifa. Is this just another excuse for you to order more gym pictures? You already have one of mine and me and Nick. Which is funny because like... Mm, I think... I don't know for sure. But I feel like me and Nick are the only people in Astraline who work out. 
every week. I might be wrong. I might be wrong, but I think so. We are the mm, gym rats of Astraline. I've been working out every week. Uh, no, it doesn't include managers, no. I think if I, you are quite active, I'd say. But you, you're, you need to stop eating chips and drinking monster. Like, how are you supposed to build muscle when all you ate is fucking Pringles, bro? Like, for real. I'm sorry, I'm slandering my manager in front of my chat again. This is like the third... <laughs> Fuck, I'm a DM <laughs> What? What's wrong? I'm slandering. I'm sorry. I'm sla This is like the third time uh, this past month that I've <laughs> slandered evil <laughs> on my stream. You know. How do you deal with the tism and gyms? Oh. That's a good question. Actually, uh, I just wear noise cancelling headphones. Noise cancelling headphones. Um, and then, I don't know. I just kind of zone out. So like, for me, this might be, it might be different for other autistic people. Like, everyone's different. But for me, if I work out hard enough, I don't care about the sensory stuff that much like you if you are working hard, out hard enough you will stop caring about everything else but there are some things that still bother me like obviously i have to wear my noise cancelling headphones and uh there's a specific kind of gym mat that has a like a kind of foam and i hate touching it like i cannot use this specific type of gym mat it drives me crazy like some kinds of foam makes me like gag i uh, but then i just like Try to find other gym mats uh, that don't have that. Um, yeah, I, but yeah, I don't know. I think if you work out hard enough, it won't really bother you that much. Uh, and thankfully, in my gym, they don't have those annoying lights. The really strong ones. Um, so that's good. Hmm. Yeah, you could bring your own mat to the gym, I suppose. I don't think people will mind. Just try to do things to accommodate yourself, basically. And if people are too loud, yeah, just blast your own music or something. You know? Yeah, the lights are fucking... <laughs> the lights can be a lot. Yeah, just try your best to, like, know your own body and what you need and accommodate yourself and... Uh, go on hours where there's not many people, if you can. When I started working out, I would work out at like 2 a.m. Just so I could avoid people. I know that sounds crazy, but <laughs> true. <laughs> I know it's not really doable for most people to work out that late. I'm not suggesting it to everyone, but like, if you can, if it's possible, Maybe go on hours that are quote unquote weird, so you don't need to deal with other people being loud, you know. Uh, at my old gym, there was a lot of loud men, like uh, men who would like work out and they would be like, Argh! and then it would just like drop the bars on the floor, and sometimes they would spit on the ground, and uh, it was really gross. Um, and that really bothered me, so I would like avoid going when they were there uh, yeah. no no not the both <laughs> oh the smells mm, yeah that can be hard you get a bit used to it I feel the smells I guess you could maybe spray some lighter perfume on yourself, like something clean, like a citrus smell. So you mostly smell your own citrus smell or something. Perhaps that could work. Mm. Yes, stinky man musk. Ooh. Ooh. Hello, Bourbon. <laughs> Oh, 
a war gas i don't do that you know like those most of those gas masks a, a lot of them anyway uh especially if they're the swedish ones they have a filter with asbestos in them so don't actually put them on you know the older ones don't do it don't do it hello dark gray otter <laughs> can you guys be normal for one minute like i look away i look away and then someone types yum asbestos <laughs> anyway i hope some of my advice helped you i feel like i'm kind of the wrong person to ask though i don't know everyone's so different what helps me might not help someone else you know we're all different creatures in this world doing different things you know it was so hard for me like when i was younger i hated any form of exercise I hated all exercise. I was like, God, I hate exercising. It's the worst ever. Like, I hated gym class. I hated exercising. And then I realized it was because I was forced to do it in school. And it was because I was forced to do things I didn't like. And I just had to find things that I liked. You know? Like, that, that was just it, right? I just had to find things that I enjoyed. And then I actually started liking it. Yeah. For sure. Alfie versus... Oh god, I hated, like... I hated running at any form of, like, exercise in school. It was horrible. Nightmare, nightmare. Well, I liked going... Like, sometimes we're going, like... Canoe trips. I liked... I liked that. Or, like, hiking. The hiking trips were also fun with school. Those were fun. And once we went... Uh, uh, what's it called in English? Like when you have a map and then you stamp stamp the stamps and you go around. That was also fun, but I was really bad at it. I got lost once. It was very scary. <laughs> I got lost in the wood. <laughs> uh, orienteering, yeah. I got lost in the woods. Yeah. Hello, Reno. How you doing? No, it's called orienteering, like... You read a map and then you go to these things and then you get stamped. And you're timed. So, the faster you do it, the better. Right? Mm. In voice scouts, yeah, it's fun. And teaches you how to read a map, which is a very useful skill that I think everyone should have. I think so. A lot of people don't know how to read maps these days. It's kind of scary, honestly. I don't know. What are you guys gonna do if the GPS doesn't work? Are you just... Are you just what the fuck are you guys gonna do? You need to learn how to read a map. <laughs> okay. I really like your Swedish accent. Min svenska dialekt. Alltså, den är lite konstig. Um, jag har en ganska unik dialekt när jag pratar svenska. Have you been to Mumindalen that's in Finland? I have not, no. Sorry for Swedish, it's okay. You can speak a little bit of Swedish, like it doesn't bother me. Uh, but I might reply in English so that everyone can understand. Um, yeah. And someone asked me in my Discord server if we would be playing this game in, uh, in, uh, in Swedish. And we will not be playing it in Swedish because I want as many people as possible to understand. Uh, we'll be playing it in English. In Finnish? <laughs> no. No. Finland, but Finnish, I don't understand at all. I only know some swear words. Uh, I like, 
rakastan. Rakastan dulu ini. You know? I wanna visit her. Like, I, I know I keep saying it. Uh, it's gonna happen. I'm just gonna... I've been busy with the whole Sabaton thing and stuff. You know? It's easy to go to Finland from Sweden. You just take this big uh, boat. I think it's called a ferry in English. And on this boat, you can you can buy many alcohols and also candy and uh, people party. <laughs> to be honest, I'll be honest, I'm just gonna eat candy in my room and play Nintendo Switch. Maybe read a book. Yeah. Mm -mm -mm. Mm. It's a it's a bit of a snusk boat to be honest. It's a it's a boat of uh, many snuskings. Yeah. For for real for real. It would be like that. Åland's fan. Va? I've never been to Åland actually. I've been to Öland when I was a kid, like uh, many times, uh, and I've also never been to Gotland either. My mom has though, like she showed me pictures from like the 90s. Åland is just Sweden and copy pasted, what? It, uh, yeah, they speak Swedish on Åland. To be meet up on the cruise ship? No, no, <laughs> no, just no, absolutely not. God, I feel like I might need some caffeine soon. Caffeine, yum yum, make me happy. Uh, uh, holy shit, I was about to reply to this person in Swedish. I, oh wait, you are Swedish, aren't you, Humpter? I, I was, also, I was precis på att svara dig på svenska. Bara för att du skrev snusmumiken. Holy <laughs> Oh my god. Oh, you're Polish? Oh, hello, Shema. How you doing? Shema, Shema. Alpha hydration, yeah. Polska. Polska guru. Many Polska. Yeah, I have a few Polish viewers. And Riz here is Polish. Uh, he's my Polish mod, so Riz he is like my my defense against toxic Polish people who come in here and tell tell me weird stuff. You know, he's a he's a wall of defense. I'm safe. Nobody can hurt me. <laughs> Sluta! Oh my God! What the fuck? I am not a snusk mumrik. I am not snusk. I am a pure maiden. I'm a pure woman. I have never had any snusk thoughts in my mind ever. There's only cleanliness in my mind. Only. Yeah. I'm not snusk. No, 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 no. Explain the snus tag. It's a it's a spell of protection. It's like an anti snus uh, like medal or something. Like yeah, it's an anti snus uh, mechanism. Yeah, don't worry about it. Okay, don't don't worry. Okay, okay, okay. Snus snus mechanism. Is Anna Rockley my role model? Endless risk, impeccable drip, anarchist lifestyle. <laughs> yes, this moment is very based. We should start the game. I wanna, I wanna see. Uh, I wanna play a game. I wanna see what kind of adventures we will go through together. 
snusmumiken. I love that the, the VTuber earlier who came in was said uh, that she was Swedish and I literally started fucking screaming uh, loudly in her ear. Well, this woman's scream at least is loud. Yeah, Jenny, yeah, you came, uh, yeah. I scream very loud. I don't know if Jenny's still here though, but she was super excited to meet you. Oh my god. Well, I she can hold my hand. Oh, she's in this. Okay, it's loud. The game? Or me? Oh, the game. Okay. Alfie? Yes? Hello? Please do not speak of such snusk. Well, I'm not speaking snusk. You are. This is a Christian Minecraft stream. She's your girlfriend. Oh my god. What? Vituba who has a girlfriend? <gasps> what? Cute. That's so cute. Language. Enable stream mode, yes, please. It's not possible. VTubers have no wrists. Okay. Frame rate. We can have 60. Accessibility. But we don't need. Okay. Actually, Alfie has a harem. It's true, I do. I have an extensive collection of waifus. Look at him. He's just a little guy. Look at him. Look at him. He's so adorable. Aww. Are we going on an adventure? Could we change the category? Wisma? Wisma? Ifa, you need to eat something else than chips. Ifa, please, I'm begging you, order some takeout. Like a normal person. Ifa, please. Look at him. Moomin and Snuff. I'll miss you terribly, Snuffkin. Are you sure you need to go? It's autumn. It's time I'll be on my way. Besides, you moomins will be sleeping all winter. I know, but promise you'll be back. I'll be back in spring, as always. And I'll be waiting for you here, on the bridge, as always. Goodbye, Moomin Troll. I'll see you in the spring. No, look how sad Moomin is. Oh no, I wanna hug him. Oh my god, no. Yeah. Yes. Eva sent me a picture of her eating chips in front of her computer, and as soon as I called her out. Look how cute he is. He's just a guy. This is Snufkin Adventure. Those heels be slain. <laughs> oh, Look how cute he is. He's going in the winter. Where is he going though? That's, I, I always wondered that in the anime when he was leaving. Like, where was he going? Like, what was he doing? You know? I, I guess fishing and, and doing winter camping, apparently. Huh? I think you're about to find out. <gasps> Snuffkin lore? It's 
snusmumiken. Han är så söt. Jättesöt. Ja, yeah, sea gurus, ja. Yeah. Det är så kul, ja. Kul humor. Väldigt söt. He's walking. <gasps> We get to control him. I'm getting close to Moomin Valley. I can't wait to meet Moomin Troll again. He should have woken from his winter slumber by now. When spring arrives, Moomin Troll can always be found waiting by the bridge. It'll be great to see him again. Okay. Hello. Look how cute. Look at the snow sparkling in the sun. Wow. So pretty. I wanna pick it up and eat it. A delectable snack. Delectable treats. It's spring, but there's still some snow left. Yeah. Look at these trees. Comfy. Okay, let's go. But where are we going? <gasps> What is this? Is it really him? Snapkin? I can't believe it! Who are you? Oh? Hello? Who's there? Yikes! Strange. Hmm. That was close. Thank you so much, Funkrabbit, for subscribing. Thank you. Thank you so much. Yippee! Hi. Hello? <gasps> Jumping. Okay. Jump. Jump. Huh? Okay. We're jumping. Uh, the bush was talking to us. Uh, I think it's a little me. Um, it could be. Uh, it could be stinky. Maybe. There he is again, the great wanderer. If I could only dare to speak to him, why would he speak to me though? Hello, who are you? <laughs> Too scared to talk. What a strange little creature. A creature? It's a creature. <gasps> what could it be, Shot? Get it together. Just walk up and say hello. Ahem. <clears throat> you must be the great Snufkin. Hello. Who are you? Ah, nobody has ever asked me that before. I... Guess I'm too small and useless to have a name. Everybody deserves to have a name. Do you really mean that? Maybe you could help me find a name. Oh, I am kind of on my way to meet my old friend Mumin Troll. That's okay. I can tag along. I can even show you around these parts. The nameless creature. Okay, we must find a name for him. Okay. Okay. I'm just gonna uh, draw my curtains like in front of my window. I did this reflecting. Okay, there we go. I should get my name from nature. Oh, from nature. Hmm. I don't know any name that would suit you. I don't know. Dave. 
Oh, look at them. They seem distressed. Maybe something happened? Even more animals leaving the valley. Oh, let's look at Otter. Yeah, but understandable. What's bothering them? Should I follow? Hmm. Huh? If you discover a leak, do you follow the flow of the water? Huh? Or do you track it back to the source? Huh? Go to where they came from. Your answer is probably there. Why would they be running from Moomin Valley? Yeah, Dogman, this is... Uh, uh, this is uh, Moomin. Climbing, okay. Can climb? I am... I am an athletic creature. I can climb many, many places. Uh, a stone. Oh. Okay. We need to pick up this stone. Maybe to make a bridge. Oh, yeah. Okay. We make our own bridge. Since nature does not have one. God, Snufkin mm. is ripped. Like, he can jump with this rock in his hand. It's kind of impressive, honestly. Bro is literally ripped. He has a six-pack six under his tunic. You know, looks can deceive, guys. Chat. Looks can deceive sometimes. Someone might look comfy, but they, they could be ripped. You never know. Mm -mm -mm. It's like the shirt meme, you know? Like when someone has a big shirt and they like... You know, pull it in. You know what I mean? You guys know what I mean. It's like that. Buffkin? He might be a buffkin. Okay. Do we need this rock for something? I don't, I'm not quite sure. What do we need it for? Ah, uh, another waterfall. Okay. Now you hold on it. We shall build our own bridge. Okay, come here. Um, little creature that doesn't have a name. Uh, hot dog water with cereal or hot dogs with milk? Uh, um, can I just say no? I don't... Do I need to... Pushing. Okay. Pushing. Okay, so he is ripped, actually. Look, this is insane. Look at the strength on this man. What? Okay, come here, little creature. We must jump over the big boulder. Okay. I wonder what we will name him. Do we get to pick the name? That friendly old chap would help us over. Try playing your harmonica for him. How do I play it? Oh. No item harmonica. Play A. Look, it's a little creature on the wall. What could this mean? Inspiration. Oh, you don't seem inspired enough to play for the creeps yet. Maybe we should look for inspiration. Okay. Need more inspiration. Okay. I think I need his help. Ah, he's back. 
Yeah, I need to level up. Can we go past here? Thank you. Thank you for that. <gasps> What's something? To gather inspiration, try running through that bush. That bush seems packed with it. We're running through the bushes. Give me the inspiration. Yippee! Give me all the info I can get. Ta -ta -ta. <gasps> we level up! Nice! Okay, let's play for him. This bird? Oh. Those bushes look inspiring. A bit hard to reach though. Try getting the bird to help by playing for it. Oh, I can launch him. I can launch the bird. God. <laughs> That's fun. I like that. Thank you so much for the raid, uh, Gada. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Comfy. Bird Force 1. You. Yeah. Bird Force. Wait, where did, how did we come come here? Oh, uh, yeah. I remember, we went through over the water. So probably we need to go back this way. Push, okay. Push, ma. Push it, baby. Push it, push it. Okay. Hello. Hello, little Koichon. Let me play you. Magical song. Ah. There, try getting it to follow. Mm -hmm. <gasps> Here we go. Tayo Typhos, thank you so much for subscribing. Thank you so much for the seven months. Thank you, thank you. I don't know why, but the, it's making me a bit nauseous. I don't know if it's the camera or what. Oh yeah, it's Swedish tits, yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. Inspired music and muscles. Young you was right, Snufkin is the perfect man. Truly, like, hangs out in nature, is rip. Uh, Plays music. I don't know. Like, what else do you need? Like, maybe uh, someone who's good at cooking. I don't know if Snufkin can cook good food. I don't know. Maybe he can. You guys think so? Maybe he is the ideal man. You know. So I need two creatures. Uh, where is the other one? I need to find the other one. Oh, I cannot go up here? Ah, na juhoto ne. Ah, the camera follows afterwards. Yeah, I'm so sensitive for that kind of stuff. Uh, but I probably will mention it to the developers anyway, just as, like, as an accessibility thing. I try to tell. Uh, game devs about stuff that I notice in the games. Um, hmm. Hello, my little creature. Uh, maybe we could use this rock to to like go up here. 
Ya. Hello. As a game dev, I appreciate that. Oh, I'm glad. I try to help, like, and give timestamps for crashes or bugs that I notice. You know, making game is hard. If I can help, I, of course, I will help. You know. Help! <gasps> help me! <gasps> what? What? You... No! We must help them. They have a dyslexic font. Oh, like a font for people with dyslexia. That's very nice. Like, I'm glad. Super cool of them. <gasps> it's Sniff! <laughs> sniff! Sniff can save me from the monster! Monster? Wait. <laughs> oh, hey, Sniff. Monster? I mean, the spider? Oh, that hurts. Maybe you are the monster, here. Oh, I think we need to send the birds. Oh. We need to send the bird so it flies into the spider. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> I'm monster! Oh. I'm free! On to new adventures! Actually, Sniff doesn't sound like that. He has a very deep voice. Uh, <laughs> but I can't. I can't do like the voice, so <laughs> it's gonna have to sound like an Ubu creature. I'm sorry, cat. <laughs> I I'm not very good at that kind of stuff. Yeah, poor spider. He was just fine. Boys, I was here first. Now I feel kind of bad. Is there anything I can do? I think there's a real possibility nothing could ever make me happy again. Not even a butterfly. A sweet, delicious butterfly. Oh. Oh god, are we gonna re-sacrifice this butterfly to the spider? Here's a butterfly for you. Sorry for upsetting you. Oh, well, the thanks, I guess. We both stepped out of line. You, the most. By far. But you are forgiven. Now leave me to my butterfly. Okay, goodbye, Mr. Speeder. Do you guys like my voices? <laughs> <laughs> it's fun to make voices for characters in games. It's yeah, I fi I find it really fun. Pro vice sector. A VA in the works. <laughs> Yeah. Mayhaps, mayhaps. Possibly. Swedish viewers in like five years be watching TV and they suddenly hear, Wow! And they're like, <gasps> flashbacks. He does sound a lot like that woman on Twitch. Oh, I wonder why. All jokes aside, it's really hard to get into voice acting and that kind of thing in Sweden because it's kind of like nepotism XE. Like, unless you have contacts or parents working in that in industry, it's very difficult. Aha, uh -huh, we need to have three creatures helping us here. 
And we need to find a name for you, my child. Bing bing bong bing 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 I'm just playing my instrument. A creature. We need to find other ones. Oh. Okay. Where's your friend? There he is. They don't make music like this anymore. <laughs> That's fun. Okay. Hello? You guys are gonna help me. Let me. Thank you so much. <gasps> no fire. Science? Rules? In nature? Who would do something like this? Yeah, who would do something like this? How dare he? How could he? signs they don't belong here go away stinky signs let me be doing nature stuff in peace anarchy in Numendalen. what's this who would ruin the scenery in this way? Something is terribly wrong. I can feel it. Who is this? Mm, we must put a stop to this shot. How dare this person defile nature in this way? Oh no, Bourbon. Such a virtuous artist, that Snuffkin. God, there's so many signs here. We must be getting closer to the source. <gasps> you aren't even allowed to make tea? No tea? What kind of monster is this person? You're not even allowed to have tea? What? No sniffer? What? What's that over there? <gasps> the police. Remember, you are doing very important work here. Huh? Say, yes sir. Remind me again what my job was. Uh, <laughs> You need to uphold these rules at all times, 24-7. We are building the valley of the future here. Uh, what about bathroom breaks? Hello? <laughs> halt! I need you to watch this park while I'm off on... Uh, Business. <laughs> okay. We'll see about that. Rules, signs? This makes me so mad. Remove the signs. Hmm. I was sure there were some rules here. Oh, 
Oh well. Better go find some rules to uphold elsewhere. So if I remove the rules, the police officers leave. Let's get rid of the rest of this park then. Oh, he is ripped. He literally just is tearing down the fence. <laughs> what? That's what I'm learning from this game is that Snooze Mimikana is fucking ripped. Yeah, that's crazy. That's actually crazy. Giga Chad Snufkin. Uh, cares for nature. Uh, will cook you a nice meal. Plays the harmonica. Goes into nature. Like, literally, Snufkin is the ideal man. I don't care what anyone says. Oh my, he's strong. He's fucking ripped, dude. I think we need buff Snufkin on. <laughs> There probably already is some on online miss. I'm sorry, but probably already exists. Oh, cinnamon buns. Yum, yum. Yum, yum, yum. Yum, yum, yum. What is snooze when we can call it in English? A snuffkin. Sorry, I keep calling him snooze when we can, but like that. I grew up with calling him that, so it's kind of weird for me to call him snuffkin. You know, I, I'm gonna try to think about it, but uh, it is what it is, you know. A man, yum yum. I want the, I want food now. I want cinnamon bun. Whoa. She is upset. One of her ducklings seemed to be stuck over there. Maybe there are more. Poor thing. Don't worry. I will keep you company while the heroic Snufkin saves your ducklings. Okay. We will help you, Mama Birdie. Don't worry. Everything's gonna be okay. Don't worry, okay? Yeah, everything's gonna be okay now. Alfie will help you. Is there a Miss Snufkin? Uh, I don't think so. Maybe? I actually don't know. Reunited with her mother, what joy! She still seems upset. Maybe there are more of her ducklings around? <gasps> oh my god, is it under the fucking... Oh no. We must save the duckling. Hello, my child. I have come to rescue you. Follow me. I think there's more. Because she still doesn't, like, seem happy. Maybe there's more, baby. Hello? Any baby? Baby? Any baby? Hello? Oh, oh this is so cute! Oh my god, what? Oh. Amazing, amazing vibes. Oh, this is so comfy. So comfy. 
Wouldn't it be nice to have this as a wallpaper? Like as an animated wallpaper? That would be so nice. Right? Just vibing. Oh, this on a mug? Or like a print? Oh, that would be so nice. Mimi? Mimi? Oh, we must use the rock to reach the little creature. Okay. Come here. What a wonderful song! <laughs> it moved to tears! Maybe that could be your name. Titi. Titi. That makes me so happy. Almost too happy. Hmm. How about Titi Woo? A happy start with a sad tail. Titi Woo. Happy, sad, and beautiful. Like life itself. I love it. I shall no longer be known as he who met Snapkin. I am Titi Wu, my own being, with my own responsibilities. Oh, so many responsibilities. Better get to them. Oh, there's a key here. Am I use it for this one? Oh, okay. Hello? Uh, oh, we must be sneaking. We must hide from the police officer. Okay. Must be careful, chat. He cannot see us. <gasps> no, I'm not here. 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 <laughs> Go away. <laughs> Post it! I don't want to see you here again! Okay. Maybe we just take it a little bit easy, okay? Oh, my hat is sticking up. Okay. Okay, we must remove the sign and shut down. Okay. Oh. Okay, that's the first one, I think. Man, what kind of egotistical creature would raise si uh, statues of himself, you know? What kind of man is this? It's kind of weird, you know. That bird is awfully quiet. Maybe I should play for it. Okay. Sneaky time activated. Oh, no smelling, no sniffer. Uh, I don't know, Riz. No! Ah! <laughs> I got busted. Yeah, I don't know, Risma. Metal Gear Snufkin. Yeah, we're doing infiltration work. We're saving nature. We can do it. I believe in myself. Yippee. Ah, this bird. <laughs> the bird is so loud. It's funny. Okay. Um. It seems that 
Maybe we need to do this. Quickly! Run away! Okay. We did it! Oh god. We're pushing the entire flower bed? Um... Okay. Wait, what? Um... How did that help? Like, how... What am I supposed to do? Oh. How... Uh, how do we move him? Like, how do we go past him? Hmm... Maybe like this. Okay, I think we're done now. Yippee! We saved nature! Coffee! Bee! Good riddance! Just wait till Moomin's roll hears about these. Poor bird, you're doing my bidding. I'm sorry I'm giving you a concussion, Mr. Bird. I didn't mean it, you know. I didn't mean it. I'm gonna take a quick five minute break, okay guys? I need to get some snackies. I'm kinda hungry. I'll see you guys in like five minutes, okay? Get some snacks for you too, okay? Be right back. Wow. Thank you. 
Hello, I got some snackies. I got some um, some yum yum, some sausage, some protein bar, and some juice. Gotta stay hydrated, ma. You know, is this like official game from the creators of Moomin? I uh, yeah, I mean, I'm pretty sure to use the Moomin moving characters in a video game and sell a game you need an officially like an official license right mm. snapkin is so cute it kind of looks like he's wearing high heels <laughs> Cute. He's just a little guy. You know? That's because he's lazy. Yeah. He does. He's going back to his boyfriend, Moomin. You know? I'm gonna eat a little bit and then we'll continue playing. Just gonna num num a little bit. I need my num num. My gamer fuel, if you will. My gamer fuel? Do you even game? Uh, did you get for a snack? Um, did you did you scroll? You like you know like you guys know, <laughs> like what I usually get. I I got some sausage. Uh, very unexpected that Alfie eats sausage on stream. I don't know. I just like the sausages, like the Polish ones. They're so yummy. You know, they're probably not good for you, uh, but um, they taste good. So you know. I can't imagine it's good for your health. <laughs> Holy shit, Moomin. Yeah, we play Moomin. Comfy Moomin game today. We bought some Follicorn. I mean, you're allowed to like things that I don't like. Just because, you know, I don't like certain stuff doesn't mean... I get grossed out when others eat it. I just don't want to eat it myself. You know? I'm not a child. I don't like go... Ew. Unless it's ketchup. That's gross. <laughs> yeah, I actually went like... When Trev was... When we went to Del Taco. And Trev ate... Uh, ketchup in front of me. I went... Ew. But I, I did it as a joke. I did it as a joke. <laughs> Mm, no, I hate ketchup. I think it's disgusting. 
Yeah, we went to Del Taco. It was okay, I guess. It's just big. It's my biggest character flaw that I don't like. You know, I don't want like ketchup. Why safety foods? Deal shut. Deal shut. Pasta tip. Mm, I like pasta. I like. It's gonna sound really weird, but like a fried egg with rice. Like egg with rice, uh, like, and a bunch of veggies. Like I like to eat veggies. Did shot is a stew. Hmm. I just don't like ketchup. It tastes too vinegary and sugary, so I don't really like it that much. It's too like, uh, it tastes too much like vinegar for me. You know? Tasty. Hydration? Mmm. Okay. I'll, I'll drink some pineapple juice. I think Dilshot is not a common. It's like a old people food. My grandma makes it a lot. But it's such a comfort food for me. Like whenever I'm sad or I'm having a bad day, I... I, I I buy this like pre-made meal with this, uh, this dish uh, and I eat it and I'm like, oh hell yeah, now we're talking. <laughs> like it just hits the spot, you know. I don't know. Fisk med egg, med egg sauce. Uh, egg sauce, also typ hollandaise sauce, eller vadå? Hmm. Egg sauce? Nej, det är ett hollandaise sauce. Inte egg sauce. I'm disagreeing with my Swedish viewer. I think they're wrong. They have the wrong opinion. Det finns egg sauce. Egg sauce låter ju inte gott. Det låter ju jättekonstigt. That sounds weird. Egg sauce? I've never heard of egg sauce before. That sounds weird. Egg sauce? It doesn't even sound good. I don't know. I feel like the food I got in school was pretty bad. Like... So basically... The area in Sweden that I grew up in was very poor. The municipality I grew up in was super poor. So the school food we got was so bad. And I lived in other cities for a while and then I moved back to my hometown. And my hometown's food, like school food, was significantly worse than everywhere else. Like really, really bad sometimes. It was honestly traumatizing. I lived in one year for, in Stockholm when I was a kid and their food was way better than ours, like on another level. But whenever I hear like Stockholm people complain about school food now, I'm like, you, you are spoiled. You don't know anything. You fool, you child. Oh, 
okay like of course sweden is wealthier than most other countries like but it varies a lot by district and your town my town that i grew up in um that didn't really have a big budget like a lot of our school furniture like the, we did we uh, we had really old computers and we weren't allowed to have sofas uh with like cloth on them in my school because the kids kept destroying them so we had these like wooden benches that were like really beat up uh and stuff like that <laughs> yeah my school was not very good like and also if you needed special assistance like you needed like help in with math or with with any other subject you had one teacher and 25 kids you know so that was very bad and i often had to wait so long to get help that i would just walk around outside instead yeah only 20 no these were all special needs kids guys it's not supposed to be like that uh like imagine being one teacher and all the kids have adhd or autism or a learning disability like it's not really good you know anyway uh let's continue playing game Okay. Let's go on adventure. Maybe we can meet Moomin. Moomin? Where are you? Moomin? Oh, what is this? A hole? <gasps> A worm, ma? Worm, ma? Holy shit. A wormus? Wormus and musk. <gasps> Musky. That's how to, how to say uh, worm in Swedish. Musk. Yeah, musk. Ah, uh, is this another worm friend? Hello? You gonna help us? Okay, thank you for the help, Mr. Worm. Oh, wiggly little boy. So he helpful. Wow. He's, he's cool. You know, he's a gamer. For sure. Oh, what are we supposed to do here? Is supposed you can practice your terrible Swedish? I don't think your Swedish is terrible. We all start somewhere, you know. If you don't practice, then you won't improve. Like it's okay. My Polish is very bad. Like I know like a few words. <laughs> like I know like. Cinque and a lot of swears and like tak dobra and Moomin Mama What has happened? Everything is so dry. Hello, Snuffkin dear. I just woke up from my winter slumber. <laughs> Moomin Troll seems to have woken up before us. He probably is waiting for you by the bridge. How are you, Moomin Mama? <gasps> well, I was looking forward to tending to my flowers, but they're all dried out. Mm -hmm. Don't you worry about that. Go see your friend now. Yeah, something happened to Moomin Mama's flowers. Maybe we can help her? And Moomin, Papa. Somebody left the window open. Hi, Moomin, Papa. How are you? I just woke up and already there's a million things on my mind. Oh. My masterpiece gone, and so is my boat. You finished your play? Congratulations. Have you seen Moomin Troll? Mm. Oh, isn't he here? Mm. Well, he's probably waiting for you by the bridge. Oh. When you see him, tell him to keep the windows shut. My theatrical masterpiece has blown all over the valley. Maybe he knows where my boat is as well. I'll be sure to keep an eye out for your play and the boat. 
Oh, Nicola, it's available on Steam. Mumin. Can we go inside? No, probably not. No. <laughs> Maybe we get to go inside later. Wowie wowie. I wonder where Lila Mi is. What could she be? Huh? I don't know. Maybe she's doing something sneaky. Hmm. I'm sure we will find out soon. You know? Sneaky. Hello, Ben. How you doing? Ah, we need to level up. <gasps> okay. Ah, we need a different instrument. A different instrument, ma? Oh, okay. What kind of instrument, ma? You're doing good, I'm glad. Have you, do you know about Moomin, Ben? Moomin is very comfy. Is Moro Moga in this game? Is she have a psychological horror tag? I don't know if she is. Um, I guess we'll find out. Maybe. Oh my god, it's Sniff! Uh, Snuffy, please help! Poor Cedric got lost in the cave while we were looking for treasure. And now this awful crab is blocking the entrance. Help me rescue Cedric. I'll help you find your friend. He must be so scared. Thank you, Snuffkin. Okay, we need uh, another instrument to save his friend. We don't have uh, the right instrument yet, so... And we found a um, uh, Moomin Papa masterpiece page. Moomin. 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 It's so funny to say. I just keep saying Moomin all the time. Moomin. Where is Moomin? <gasps> oh, a mushroom? A shwoomba? Yum, yum, yum. Uh, thank you so much, uh, Adrian, for subscribing with, uh, to Tier 2 for 21 months. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. I love you. Wow, 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 wow. And thank you, Cozy White Bear, for continuing your gift sub. Thank you. Uh, so in moving here and then suddenly it wasn't that known in my area. Oh, I see. You should watch it now. It's never too late. You know, you should read a moving book. I'm totally not biased because I'm Nordic, not at all. Uh, totally not. Oh no, what's happened? It's all dry and messed up. <gasps> oh my goodness. There's dead fish too. No. The river is gone and Moomin Troll isn't here. What has happened? Oh no. I must find out what has happened to Moomin Troll. And the river, it can't just disappear? Yeah. <gasps> Little bee! Hello. Hello, hello. Took you long enough to get here, stuff kid. <laughs> Was there a butterfly somewhere in desperate need of being appreciated? <laughs> a majestic waterfall having to be taken in? Hello, little me. Did you say something happened to Moomin's role? Hmm. Oh, yes. A most horrible fate. Mm -hmm. Moomin was asleep. His lazy winter slumber. Not a care in the world. Ah. Quite selfish, if you ask me. Then suddenly she appeared. Holy shit, guys. The Gvok Moran. <gasps> Moran is here, chat. Holy shit. Holy shit. 
Ian movement struggle with him was just intent and he just envy. She took him and ran into the forest, poor Moomin troll kicking and screaming. You saw that with your own eyes? Uh -huh. I have to run for my own life. That's the gist of it, so you probably won't be seeing him again. Dun 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 dun. Is little me telling the truth? I better go investigate. Oh, holy shit. Moomin is kidnapped by Moran? By the Grok? What? No way! We must save him, chat! We must save him! Ugh, more police officers. Maybe they could actually help out. Have you seen my friend Moomin Troll? I think he's been kidnapped by the Grok. <laughs> Nobody's allowed in the building site. No Moomin Trolls, no animals, <laughs> and certainly no Groks. Now be gone. We have important work to do. Forget it. I'll figure this out myself. Oh, the animals are scared. These animals look distressed. Oh no, can we help you? Oh, poor babies. Look at the bunny, so scared. Oh, I hug them. Okay. Oh, you can run now? Oh, there's a, s a stamina bar. Yeah. Okay. It's getting colder here. This cloak must be around. Okay, oh my god. This is literally giving me childhood trauma. Like, literally, like, what the fuck? Very scary. Very, very scary, guys. Oh no! No! <laughs> there she is! No! No way! <laughs> no! Oh my god. No! This is all over. Oh my god. No! <laughs> oh my god. They knew what they were doing with this. They knew. They knew, like the developers know that all Scandinavians have like childhood trauma related to Morian. They're just they're just trolling us. The developers are trolling us. <laughs> nah. supposed to do oh my god this is coming ah. <laughs> hurry up hurry up snus will make in hurry up we must flee where's moomin oh god i think she's gone now i think she's gone now <gasps> moomin <gasps> moomin troll come see old friend oh no <laughs> what happened to him <laughs> What? <laughs> what the hell happened to him? Is he okay? Oh my god, she's... No, we must run away! But the devs knew what they were doing with this. It's, it's like literally childhood trauma. Oh my god, she's so fast. Are you kidding me? Press, 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 press! No, 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 no. Push, 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 He's gonna get... Yeah! 
Oh no. Okay, let's go. Hurry! Come in! Stay from my gun! Queen Danu! Moran is a female? Yeah, she is a woman. Yeah. Mary Troll has got to be this way. Quickly! We must run away! Yeah, I don't think Chat understands how terrifying she is. I don't think Chat gets it. Holy shit! No! Oh, come on! No! Go away! No! Please! Save me! Move in! Save me! Please! Move in! Move in! Move in! Save me! Save me! Save me! No! 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 Oh no! We'll be here. Thank you for that. I thought it was done for. Did the Grok scare you? She is attracted to your lamb. She's harmless, really. Your friend Moomin Troll realized that. So Moomin Troll was here? He sure was. Moomin Troll came here, side by side with the Grok. <laughs> Seeing the devastated forest, he tried to talk to the police, but they sent him off. And that's the last I saw of him. So, Moomin Troll was here with the Grok, but voluntarily? Sweet Moomin Troll, how typical. And how typical of little me to exaggerate everything. What's that? Smoke? Better investigate. Wait, Moomin is a rabbit? No, he's not a rabbit. Moomin is uh, a, 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 he's a troll, like a kind of troll. Yeah. Yeah, he's a troll. He's not a rabbit. They're burning. <coughs> the sweet smell of progress. The park keeper should see us now. We're doing <coughs> excellent work. He will be thrilled when he returns from the island. You can't have a fire here. It's too dry. Relax. We've got this under control. Uh, yeah, no, you don't. Stupid. Uh, highly irregular. Maybe you should show the scene from the animated show. I don't know if I'd get copyright strike for that reason. So hot. <gasps> no. Ouch. Where am I supposed to go? <gasps> no. No, me, me, me. Oh, the Grok. She's saving me. The Grok, she seems to be drawn to the flames. Yeah, help me! Help me, Grok. Help me. Let's get rid of all these flames. You know, at least this one too. Get rid of this one. Okay. Good job, Moran. Okay, could you go here? Okay. Good job, good job. <laughs> Moran was here to stop the industrial revolution. Yes. Okay. Let's go. Let's go, Moran. Let's save the environment, Ma. Yippee. Good job. You are doing such a good job, Moran. I'm so proud of you right now. Holy shit. Few more to go. Saved by the Grok. 
Now to deal with these police officers. What great work we did here. Nature tried to stop us, but we won. This was all your fault! Any complaints must be taken up with the park keeper. Where is he? I think we told the other guy who kept pestering us. He's at the Hatifnatur's island doing important business. <laughs> now leave this park. No. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Oh. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Snapkin, you saved our home. Please have this flute as a token of your or, or appreciation. It's made from our favorite tree. It's all that remains from it. I didn't save the forest. The Grook did. Oh, dear Grook. Our hero. Our savior. Mm. My friend. Oh, cute, ma. Goodbye, Morgan. My forest can start to regrow now that the police officers are gone. Okay. Oh, look how ugly they made everything. Wow, wow, wow. Very strong. Hello. So, Milmin Chol went looking for the park keeper. Mumin, what are you doing? Mumin! Morin is the saddest character in Mumin. Imagine if everything you touched instantly froze solid. Yeah, you can never, you can never hug anyone. Because they would die. Yeah. Morin is sad. Like a very sad character. Yeah. Moran needs a hug. She's very scary though, like, uh, she does freak me out. I will not lie, like, she does freak me out a little bit. What? <laughs> What's the problem? Got a terribly sore throat. Probably on account of this rope that's tied around my neck. Can you give me a hand? I promise I won't eat you or anything. It's not like I could swallow you anyway, with this rope around my neck and all. That's reassuring. I'll see what I can do. Finally! Freedom! Thank you so much! Now, oh, please take that rope far away. Thanks. I'm sure it could be quite useful. Okay. What if we eat me now, though? An egg. An egg. Egg. Here we go. Egg ma. What is over here? Angel 
Aileen. Thank you so much for subscribing. Thank you, thank you. Yippee. Du verkar cool och snäll. Cool och snäll. Cool och snäll. Oh. Tack så mycket. Jag försöker mitt bästa. Wow. Hallå, krabbu. How do I change instruments? It's echoing inside the cave. Do you guys hear that? It's kind of a cool effect. You know? Oh, running through the mushroom gives you inspo. No more crab... No more crab ra rave ra allowed. Only snuffkin rave allowed. Come here, me and Sniff. Come on, me and Sniff, we're having a rave in the cave. We need to find his friend. What could it be? Maybe here. There you go. Hello. Hello, Aswell. Thank you so much for the for the three months. I hope you're having a good day. I am having a good day. I am having a good day. I'll feel hard. I'm just I'll a sleepy little are baby are a good day. today. Oh, we sleep, little baby. I need a hug, I think. Maybe. Can you give me one? Can I have a hug? Thanks. Yeah. I'm a bit deflated today. That's okay. We're playing comfy game. We're just vibing. Oh, thank you guys. You're so nice. I love you guys so much. <gasps> look how pretty. Look, 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 look. Pretty. And it's a dolphin or a whale or something. Oh, Sniff is so scared. <laughs> He's always scared of everything. Sniff is very baby. Yeah, there's a moving game, yeah. It recently came out. You can click the link if you want to check it out. Like, uh, guys, remember to click the link. It really helps me out. And also makes the developers see, like, um, do you like the game? And, you know, they work very hard. So, I'm sure they will be very, very happy. Oh, oh my dear Cedric, I will never leave you alone again. Oh, thank you, Angel. You're a very kind person as well. Thank you. I hope that you have a wonderful evening and that you eat some really comfy food. Something yummy. I'm probably... What am I going to eat today? Actually, I don't know. I might make some tomato soup with grilled cheese, honestly. Today? Or some fish. Mm, fish, maybe. What? You mean to tell me that Cedric is a toy? Uh -huh. Oh, how rude. He is much more than a toy. Okay, then. Anyhow, we have to look for another way out now. Uh -huh. uh, yes, this cave is awful stuff, kid. Get me out of here. <laughs> the way the kangaroo picked up and held the dog made me laugh. I don't think he's a kangaroo. I, I, a sni what is a sniff? Like, what kind of cre creature? I don't know, actually. What kind? What kind of creature is Sniff? I don't know. He's just a creature. I don't know if they do they specify. Wait, I'm gonna Google. Sniff. 
Nyd min. Uh... Nej. It says in the stories. It, it doesn't... They don't say what kind of animal he is. Uh... Yeah, it doesn't say. You're featured as broadcasting on the stream link. Really, I am? <laughs> That's nice. Hello, Steam. Yippee. That's comfy. But yes, um, it doesn't say what kind of animal Sniff is. Uh, but it says here on Wikipedia that uh, he might be some kind of hybrid between a rat and a kangaroo. Uh, or also an opossum. Uh, but yeah, it doesn't really specify. It says here, race, unknown animal. Mm -mm -mm. A rataroo? I don't know. Yeah, it doesn't say what kind of animal he is. It is a mystery. I don't know. Only Sniff knows, I suppose. He's a kangarat. Yeah, maybe he's a kangarat. He could be a little kangarat. It's so fun to play this flute. I love it a lot. <gasps> Gold. <Wow. gasps> Treasure. Wait. Oh no, Sniff, don't take it. Oh, it's so beautiful! I... I don't see what's so special about it. Uh-oh. <gasps> no! Cedric! Do something, Snufkin! Okay. Thank you. Uh, it's his treasure. It's the oh. crab's treasure, not ours. Cedric, please forgive me for dropping. I mean losing you. Oh, oh Cedric. How wonderful to have earned your forgiveness. There. Let's get out of the cave. But... But... The treasure... Do, do you want to risk losing Cedric again? Oh. <gasps> no, of course not! Don't look at me like that, Cedric! Okay, we help Sniff. Let's get out of here. Let's give Sniff back to Moomin Mama. <laughs> Sweet relief. That was close. Uh -huh. Thank you so much for your help, Snufkin. You two stick together now. Uh -huh. Wait, what's that, Cedric? Snufkin seems lonely, you say? Uh -huh. Here, Snufkin. Cedric wants you to have this companion. Uh -huh. You might like some of Cedric's charm and impulsiveness, but he is a structured and trustworthy fella. Oh, thank you. Um, both of you. Oh, he mulen. Oh, he mulen. Wow, beast. He mulen. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. What is this? Seaweed. Oh, tasty. He mulen. Oh. Moomin Papa's masterpiece. Moomin Papa, oh Moomin Mama. Moomin Mama, oh Moomin Papa. 
Oh, oh, I need the drum thingy. I don't have it. Very sconculated. What is this? Oh! Moving, Papa's old boat is gone. Hello, Tutiki. Did you see who took Moomin Papa's boat? Hmm. Nafkin, a sight for sore eyes. Yes, it was our old friend Moomin Troll. Hmm. He was looking for the park keeper on the Hatif Nutters Island. I've got a bad hmm. feeling about this. I should go after him. Hmm. hmm. A bit difficult without a boat, I reckon. Huh. Hmm. Hmm. I guess I could help you build a raft, but I've been needing some materials. Anything. What do you need? Mm -hmm. Three lugs for the body, mm. a sick for the mast, ah. some rope, uh -huh. and some cloth for the sail. Slug, stick, rope, and cloth. Get right on it. Okay. I think we can do this, you know. Oh. Oh, this is just like the TV show. I always, like, when I watch the TV show, I always wanted to sit inside of this and, like, look out on the ocean, like, vibing, you know? I don't know. It seems so dreamy to me to, like, sit in this little thing and watch the sea. Dreaming away, you know? Yeah. Pretty. There we go. Keep hydrated. Yeah, oh. keep hydrated more. Hello? You've taken all I've got. I haven't taken anything. <laughs> it's a dune sandworm? Oh no. That's not good. Why? Just because I'm invisible doesn't mean you can steal my clothes. Somebody stole from you? I can help. I think... Hi, I'm Snufkin. Hi. Oh, I thought you were stinky. Stinky? That's not a compliment. Oh. I'm sorry. Of course I see that you look different. I was just upset. Hey. I'm Ninni. Nice to meet you. Did Stinky steal your clothes? Why? Yes. He ran off with them while I was taking a swim. Oh. He said I didn't need them, since I'm invisible. But I'm really cold. Stinky will get away with this. I'll get your clothes back. See you soon. Uh, I mean... Hi. I know what you meant. <laughs> see you soon, lol. You can't see. Because he's, she's invisible. But yeah, does anyone who's seen the show remember the episode with the invisible girl? It's her. Yeah. It's her. Oh, how do we get up here? We use a stone, maybe? Stone ma? Hello? Oh, forget it. Haven't seen her in any episode. There is an episode with her. I'm pretty sure. I'm like 99% sure that I remember. Oh, look, there's another part here. You're not allowed to wear shoes? What kind of rules are these? No shoes? Oh no! The bug is angry! I'm sorry, sir. I am simply restoring the peace in nature. I didn't mean to offend you. 
Oh, hello. Oh, a swoon, wa? Hello again. Oh, hello. I should probably invite you to sit. Is that an invitation? I guess. So... So... If I just had some chanterelles and a porcini, I could make a nice stew. Perhaps you could get me some. Sure, a stew sounds lovely. Oh, you want some too? Alright. <laughs> oh, what? It was like... Can you get these ingredients for me? And Snufkin's like, oh yeah, sounds good. And then the muskrat's like, uh, uh, yeah, you can have some too, I guess, lol. Man, I am not an errand boy. Come on. I am, I am much cooler than that. I am D Snufkin. Porcini? Porcini? I don't know. Porcini. Bice. Wow! Okay. I didn't, don't think these bugs like me. No oh, cute bird. Yeah, so cute, ma. Cute, my bird, ma. One moment, guys. Let's fix this park. <gasps> what? There's a ghost. No. Hi. Oh. Aren't you afraid of me either? Oh. I'm sorry. N no. Oh, that's so sad. I can't even scare a fly. Oh. And I just keep getting smaller and smaller each time I fail to scare someone. Mm, I think I can help you. You can? How? If we work together, I could try to bring some unsuspecting victims here. Oh. Maybe Sniff could be a good victim. He gets scared at everything. <laughs> For sure. Sniff gets scared at everything. He's such a baby. Make sure they don't catch you. Wait. Oh, okay. <laughs> no. Is the ghost here still? In the park? Yeah, okay. They go. <laughs> Spooky ghost. There we go. I think that's all of them. Oh, now the ghost is really big. Maybe there's more to do? Oh yeah, okay. Come over here! <laughs> Come over here, Mr. Police Officer! I'm totally not gonna scare you! There you go. Teamwork, baby. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> I need to stretch my... 
Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, that was so much fun. Thank you, Snuffkin. Don't mention it. That was truly my pleasure. Maybe you want my spare shade of cloth. You can be a ghost like me. Ah, uh, that cloth looks like it would be the perfect sail for a raft. Thank you. God, it looks so weird when I have my crown and my hat on at the same time. <laughs> Wowie. Okay. It was small in the beginning. We helped it grow big. Huh? Hmm. Okay, so we need a large stick and lumber. So that what you that's what we're missing right now. Hmm. And we don't have this like drum instrument either. Uh I think this is like where we came from before, right? Oh, we can- oh, we have a map. Oh. Get logs for movement, papa. Snork. Oh, we're gonna meet Snork for again. Oh. Okay, let's go over here. Okay, apparently Snork is up here somewhere. Let's try, try to find her. Snork Adventures. You're snorking around. Oh, me! Hello? What are you doing, treasure hunting? I am finding materials for Tutiki. So spacious to say the least. I'll be keeping an eye on you. Thanks for leading me on a wild brook chase, by the way. Me, such a little creature. Oh, this is not Snork. Uh, Farkin, this is just Snork. Okay. Hello, Snuffkin. I'm playing a fun game for two. Oh. By myself. Oh. We're building a raft. And I was wondering if I could borrow that stick as a mast. Hmm. Nah. Not unless you win against me in this unfalling game. Mm -hmm. Which you won't. Hmm. What are the rules? Oh. The first stick that makes it to those flags down there wins. Mm -hmm. Also, no laying your hands on the stick once the game has started. Mm -hmm. But you'll need to bring a stick of your own uh -huh. first. Although, I doubt you'll find a stick as impressive as mine. Alright, I'll be back. Why do we find the stick? Ah, oh, uh, here's a stick up here. Never mind. Uh, stick, ma. Thank you. Can you do a Finnish accent? No, it was sound, it was sound horrible. It was absolutely sound horrible. No, I don't think so. It would just sound like I'm mocking the Finnish language. I suppose you could watch Lumi play this and she will do a Finnish accent for you. Yes. I am preventing a stick from winning. Mm. 
there we go. Yeah, I wanna rewatch the movie now. Honestly. I wanna watch Moomin. And be comfy. Isn't that considered cheating? No, it's not! It's not cheating! No, it's not cheating! It's not cheating! It's not cheating, guys! Wow, you won! My calculations are completely wrong. Well, I guess this is useless for me now. Here, you can have it. Thank you. See, yeah, I wasn't touching the fish. The stick, the fish was touching the stick, but I wasn't. So actually, I was not cheating at all. Just so you know, logic. Okay. Uh, okay. So let's go to Moomin Papa. <laughs> <laughs> I'm innocent chat. Don't come for me. Oh, there's a page there. How do I get it? Mm. Yeah, it's so comfy, right? I really like this game. They did such a good job, but like... It's exactly the same vibe as the books and the TV show, so... Yeah, Snork didn't say that I couldn't manipulate to win, so like, hey, hey. Get owned, I guess. Lol. Hmm. There's a bird up here. Hello. Mr. Birdman. Snork made his anklet. Oh, where where is Snork? Fucking then. I don't know. It seems we cannot go here. At least not yet. Is there anyone here? There we go. Lots of ants everywhere. I don't know where they're all coming from. This game is so comfy. Who is better at playing the flute, Snufkin or Link? I don't think... Link plays flute. Doesn't he play ocarina? Oh, it's a page! Nice. Thank you. Nippy! I need to become tall. Tall, ma. I am just a creature. Mm -hmm. So now the only thing we're missing is the lumber, I think. And somehow we need to find Snorkfuck and then give back her anklet. Oh, what is this? Oh, pretty. Comfy. Oh, it's so wholesome. Okay. Mm. 
I miss summer, me too. But technically in this game it's spring, not summer, so... You know. Yeah, I miss summer too. I want to go hiking with friends. And have picnics and that kind of stuff. I want to live this Snufkin life, you know. Just vibing. I like spring better than summer. Mm, I like spring. And I'm, I don't know. I think I like spring more, yeah. Summer is so warm. And humid here. It's kind of annoying. A little bit. Oh no. What's happening? God. Why were they blocking my path? You like autumn the best? Mm. Yeah, it depends on where you live, right? For sure. Hello! Do you have any lumber? <laughs> Snufkin, did you meet Moomin Troll? It seems he's gone to the hut if not there's island. <laughs> ah, he's got his sense of adventure from me. Don't be surprised if you find my boat there. Mm. Now, come give an old fellow a hand. Oh. Okay. okay. Almost done. Phew, what an ordeal. Thank you, Snufkin. <laughs> Please help yourself to some logs. Thanks a lot. Yeah, that should be it. Two ticket can build a raft now. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Uh, so now the only quest is help Nini recover her clothes. We should probably do that too. For sure. Let's go to the beach. Beach says to get away. Wait, first we need to get his clothes, her clothes back. I forgot about that. Man, why would you steal a, a woman's clothes like this? Ah, it seems we cannot do that yet. Hmm. Perhaps we need to go to the beach first. I don't know if we can pass through here yet. Mm, maybe not. It seems maybe not. Mm. Yeah, this is from Moonmin. This is Moonmin game. Yeah, this is Snufkin. Why do you need to wear clothes if you're invisible? Well, you'll be cold, won't you? can't just have your butt bare in the air, you know. You need to cover it up so you don't get super cold. Don't you think? In summer, yes. I guess. Yeah. You're from Lumituber? Oh, you're, you're a Lumi viewer. Oh, hello, hello. Welcome, welcome. That's it. I can build you that raft now. Why? Yeah. Well, two tickies are just building it. Look how pretty. Uh huh. That's it. This raft should hold up nicely. Uh -huh. Just try to stay away from rough weather. Mm -hmm. Also, you should have this old map. It belonged to my grandfather. Mm. 
It's just been hanging on my wall. I hope it can help you navigate the Hathif Nathus Island. Me? What are you doing here? <laughs> Going treasure hunting without me? I'm looking for a moving troll. That's clearly a treasure map. I'm coming with you. I'd prefer to travel alone. It, it might be dangerous. Mm. Trying to keep the treasure for yourself? You'll regret this. Oh no. What is she gonna do? I don't trust her. <laughs> what is she gonna do? Hello, Mori. Yes, I'm playing Moo meme game today. Look at the absolute vibes right now. This impeccable vibes. Thought you could shake me out of treasure? Oh no. Oh. This is all your fault. What? You should be happy we made it in one piece. I sure hope Moving Troll did the same. Mo me is such stinky creature. Yeah, she ruined everything. Yeah. Oh, such a gremlin, ma. Moving Troll, where are you? Fishy, where are you? Moomin Troll. I needed to focus, Nafkin. I guess two heads work better than one. <gasps> Look! We see the prince. Moomin Papa's boat. The sail is gone, though. I'll get to that after I find Moomin Troll. You need to get your priorities straight. I am claiming the treasure for myself. Good luck finding that dollar. I'm better of alone. I say tired to her fog and leave her. <laughs> this is the child. We no. We need to take care of her. I got this guy by face doing a lady struggle. Hmm. Rumors say that there's a pirate ship around here somewhere. Oh. Very interesting, ma. <gasps> A pirate ship. We could use that sail. On the boat. Isn't that smart? A pirate ship. Could little me be right about the treasure? The ship is wrecked, but the sail seems intact. Maybe we could fix Moomin's Papa boat with that. That's what I said. Ho <laughs> ho. That's what I said. I think it's also Moomin uh, troll tracks here. This game is cute. I know, it's adorable, right? Oh, this fish is moving. Scary. Creature inside. Careful, creature inside. Oh, we must find the moomin. Moomin! What are you doing? Oh my god. It's a Tifnati. Oh no. They're just little creatures. Look at them. They're vibing. I was very scared of these as a kid, actually. It, I was terrified. Hello, Saffron. I didn't realize it was you. Hello, Saffron. I hope you're doing well today. Love ma, love my saffron. 
I appear, she appears. She is present, even. I don't know what's going on. Tifnaki. Hello. <gasps> we need a rock so we can jump. Or something. How do we get there? A <gasps> Tifnaki. Oh, oh, oh. We need to move this somehow so it can float past, you know? And we can take the page from the other place. You know? There you go. Thank you! Oh shit. A uh, uh, crocodile. No, no, no. The treasure will soon be mine. I wonder what I'll buy, what I'll buy with that treasure. How's the treasure hunt going? How's not having any sense of adventure going? I don't know. I feel like. We've been on a pretty good adventure so far, to be honest. I feel like it's going quite well, you know. Even if it's been an accident. Thank you so much for helping me, Snake. Yeah, little me can be a bit rude sometimes, to be honest. Which direction is it going? Here? Up here? Oh. Ah, pirate! Ah. Afraid to get your feet wet? Typical land crab. Ah. Try using the barrels to cross. Okay. Okay. There we go. Okay. Are you guys kind of creepy? I think so. I don't think so. Hmm. Maybe we need to get more than one barrel to cross. Think the Hati Fanatters like music, guys? Are they music enjoyers? They could be. You never know. You don't know until you've tried. You know? Huh. I guess we cannot go this way. Aha! Uh -huh. There you go. It's not getting so strong, it's insane. What the hell? is not here to relish in my misfortune. What? Hmm. Aha! Finally here to help, are you? 
Have you found the treasure? <laughs> I am so close I can smell it. Oh, that's just you. <laughs> You're so evil! I'm not stinky. I showered. Oh my god. I showered today. Come on. I'm not a stinky person. Oh my god. You evil child. Look how pretty it is the night sky. Pretty. <laughs> yeah, movement is very comfy, Saffron. You should watch the TV show someday. Or read the books. Or you could play this game. Yeah. Remember to click the link, guys, if you like the game. To support me and the developers. There was a show, yeah. There's two different shows. And a movie, I think. There was a movie because I didn't see that. Fuck. Why did I know you were gonna play this game when I saw it come out? <laughs> I mean, that just means you know me. You know? <gasps> Nicely done. Give it a few years and you could probably become a decent pirate. I don't want to be a pirate. Is this game really demanding? Uh, no, it's not really demanding. It's comfy. Arr, arr. Have you given up running Moom in Troll? Poor Hattif Natters. A Moolen. Please, the Hattif Natters need your help. I'm kind of on a mission already. Find my friend, Moomin Troll. Moomin Troll, you say? He was just here to help me. Must have been unsuccessful, though. I haven't seen him since. Where did he go? Into the park. To convince the park he could to be. To convince the park to give the barometer back. Barometer? I don't understand anything. Try to keep up. The park keeper has built a hideous park in the middle of the Hadith Nadu's territory. Locking their sacred barometer inside. Their totem. Their most precious item. It's been a while now and Mumintol hasn't come back. Something must have happened. Mumintol, I'm coming to get you. And the barometer. Comfy. Are you gonna play Dragon's Dogma 2? Yes. Yes, 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 I am. I look forward to it. I forgot which day it launches though. I I'm going to birthday dinner next week, so I hope it's not on the same day. It might be. What which day is it? Ah, they have dug this up in this entire area. Probably looking for treasure. No respect for professional pirates. 17th? Oh, okay. No, then I'm home. Good. Moomintol mm -hmm. went in here, alone. Hope I'm not too late. What are these? Dogs? Bats? What are those? Hmm, I wonder if fireflies like music. Ok. 
Okay. <laughs> Go to sleep. Yeah, I'm feeling very sleepy. There you go. No, they put all the animals in the cages. How could you do this? This is not okay. Oh no. This park is so big. Oh shit, fuck it. Bruh. Suddenly, I became a monkey. Uh oh. Bing, 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 bing. Okay. We got this. We got this shot. Shortcut. Oh. oh, boop. Oh. Oh, no. Okay. Mm. Hello? There we go. Putting you all to sleep. A little baby. trapped in a cage. Thanks for asking. Mm. Just like all the other animals here. Anything I can do to help? <laughs> well, removing the park and freeing me would be a start. Mm. I've seen them hiding objects beneath some of those hideous statues. Mm. I get the feeling it must be something important. Mm, okay. Disrespect your surroundings. Okay. Yeah, the sea creature seems to be very nice. Must be the hat if not the spirometer. Broken glass and signs of struggle. If the pie keeper has touched his mustard one hair and movement towards hairless head. <laughs> oh no, movement towards hairless head. There we go. Okay. I can't go that way. Too many hat if not this. The hat if not are reunited with their barometer. Finally, take this drum as a symbol of my gratitude. It may help you with the local wildlife. Thank you. I've actually been looking for one. It's fun to bang the drum. 
I can pretend I am monkey. With a little drum. I hope you are better now. Do I know you? You all kind of look the same to me. Doesn't matter. I know your freedom. You too. Man, I wish I wish everyone was as nice as Snufkin. Holy shit. Like, I wish that everyone was as nice as Snufkin. You know, the world will be a better place. For sure, if that was the case. Everyone should be aspire to be more like Snufkin. For for real, for real. Okay. Playing the song of my people. Oh. <laughs> oh my god, no! How could you steal him? Oh my god. Hmm. Snowfkin, help me! <laughs> by the power vested in me by myself, I'm taking you back for imprisonment in Mubin Valley! Did you say that? Yes, the park keeper just arrested poor Moomin Troll. Oh, not that, the pirate ship. Enough of this pirate nonsense. I need to go after Moomin Troll. Uh, somehow. Uh -huh. Exactly. But Moomin Papa's boat is nowhere going nowhere without a sail. Luckily, there's a perfectly good sail on that pirate ship. Uh -huh. And most likely, a perfectly good treasure. So... How about we work together? Goodbye, little me. Okay, so... I think that is all for today. Maybe we will continue playing this next week because I like this so much. It's so comfy. Uh, but I'm really hungry now, so... I think we're gonna end it here. My stomach is screaming for... I'm actually gonna make egg with rice, I think. Or bacon with rice, or some kind of rice bowl today, yeah. Mm. You're welcome, Falke. It was nice to meet you. Lots of stuff happened today. Lots of stuff. Very, very busy day. School, eh? School! Egg Mary's. Nom nom. Gotti. And then I'm gonna watch Shogun. Anyone else watching Shogun right now? Or probably most of you, right? <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna watch Shogun today. Is it on right now? Uh, I think a new episode dropped today, right? Yeah, Shogun, yeah. The remake. I really like it. It's really good. It's so comfy. First time here. I hope you like it. It's very nice to meet you. Hope you're nice to meet you. Found you on YouTube. You did? I'm glad. I think it comes out today, but I'm not completely sure. I think so. I think it's today. I don't know. <sighs> yeah, let's raid someone today. Have you gotten Helldivers 2 working? No. I don't know why Helldivers doesn't work for me. I have tried everything I can find on Reddit. I have uninstalled and installed the game multiple times i've tried to launch it on different drives i have upgraded my graphics cards drivers uh i have basically tried almost everything i can think of at this point i'm thinking that it's a hardware issue like that some part in my computer and the game just don't like each other and i don't know which part it is like i i don't know which part it is is it my graphics card is it like my processor, like what, well, like what in the computer doesn't Helldivers like? Are you running Windows 10? Yes. 
I am wondering when I, I refuse to upgrade to Windows 11. I refuse. Is that a thing? Uh, no, uh, I got a 4070 graphics card. Uh, so basically when I launch Hell Divers, I get into the tutorial and then it's like the ship lands, I get out, crash instantly. Crash instantly. Like, it sucks. No, it launches and it crashes as soon as the ship lands in the tutorial. I don't- I haven't even seen the title screen, guys. I haven't even seen the fucking title screen or like the settings or anything. Like, it crashes in the tutorial. Like, as soon as I get out of the ship, crash. I don't know what the cause is. Like... I don't know what, what, like I said, I think it's something in my PC. Uh, I don't know. Uh, there was a viewer who offered to fix it with me, like try to fix it with me. Uh, so I think I'm going to ask him for help. Hello Bjorn, if you're here. Yeah, Bjorn knows who he is. Anyway, let's find someone to raid and I can go and eat some yum yummy dinner. Um, let's raid my wife today, Bino. Why did my keyboard change itself to Japanese? <laughs> okay, anyway. Let's go. Goodbye, everyone. I'll s uh, today, this week's schedule is a bit different because I'm taking a lot of time off uh, because uh, of the thing. Uh, you know, like um, I, I, um, I rehomed my dog, basically. I'm not feeling the best. I am trying to deal with, deal with it emotionally. The fact that my dog is not here anymore. So I'm taking time off to deal with that, guys. Uh, I'll talk more about it on Saturday. I didn't really want to talk about it today. Because I don't want to cry on stream and shit. So uh, Anyway, we'll talk about it on Saturday. I'll see you guys then. I'm taking time off to like process and relax and stuff like that. Uh, but I'll be fine. I'll be fine, guys. If you're interested in learning more, you can go on my Twitter or on my Discord, okay? In the meantime. Don't worry too much about me. I'll be fine. Uh, I love you guys so much. Bye-bye. I love you. Big kiss. Bye-bye. See you on Saturday. Bye-bye. SKA, hello. I love you. Bye-bye.